We are going to be doing some DIY today. I'm very excited about it. So I wanted to go for like an artist fit. Okay. Cause we're getting funky. We're thinking outside the box today, girls. And so I have this top on, which is just super fun. I thrifted it, but I believe it's like from Walmart, um, mustard collar stripes, of course, put on these blue pants. Then look at this I walk in my closet. Okay. I'm like, okay, I'll probably wear Converse, right? That's what I always wear. Then I caught these out of the corner of my eye and I was like, it was made for this outfit. It wasn't even like an intentional thing. Mustard laces, blue check. See mustard, mustard, blue check. And then the bottom of the shoe, how graceful is that? Same color as this. They are just so fun and so perfect. I cannot wait to show y'all what we got at the estate sale of those two sisters. I walked in and was like, is this like one person's belongings? Because we're going on the second day and then the house was completely full of like jewelry and fashion items and quilts and books and like tons of amazing things and i'm like this is so much stuff especially for it being the second day of this sale and i asked and that's when they were like actually it was two sisters and they got dressed up to watch tv there wasn't a day that went by they didn't get dressed up even if they didn't leave the house and this is they loved fashion and then when i went around the house i'm like they love fashion and they love jesus a lot and it was just such a cool experience Oh, and one of the pieces that I picked up, I just picked it up. Y'all know me, just picking things up, not looking into it, just, just looking into it later. I literally just pick it up, glance at it, and just hand it to Brandon, and he goes, like, adds it to my pile. We love a supportive king. And he was like, did you look at this? And I'm like, oh, no. And he, like, shows me, and it had something engraved on it that was pretty cool. Stay tuned. I'll tell you guys when I post the reel of our full haul. Anytime I go shopping with Memphis, she's like my little partner in crime. Tulsa could care less, but Memphis is all about it. And I'm always like, okay, you're my fashion designer today. This is what I'm looking for. And then we like pretend she's my designer or my personal stylist. And then we have fun. Like it's like a game when we go shopping. So today she's like, what are you shopping for today? Like, what can I help you find? And I'm like, I need to find fabric. I want to make my daughter a dress. So then she found a really cool top sheet that we're going to make a dress out of, hopefully. Last thing before I go, one these ladies had a full hot tub room inside of their home, okay? The amount of like add-on little rooms these women had, they were truly living their best lives, okay? They were like, we should, I just know. One of them was like, we should put a hot tub in here. And the other one was like, yes, let's do it. And then they have a hot tub in their home. In their home, it's not like a big fancy house, like a hot tub room. This is a cute little tiny old house. Walk around the corner, what do you see? A massive jacuzzi. Queens, queens! Second thing, I love an estate sale and it reminds me of why I do what I do. I am doing what I do and I find these incredible things so that one day there is a line that goes all the way down my street for my estate sale, okay? And it is so big and so grand and it is so crazy and there's gonna be girls walking around my estate. This isn't 100 years, so like chill. We're not, you guys won't be there. Um, we won't be partying in heaven. Amen. But I just want there to be a line that's like, just people are going crazy. People are fighting over my stuff. That's, I, I gotta go. I gotta go. Someone remind Karen of that next time they say, where are you going to put all that stuff? You shop too much. Where are you, what are you going to do with all this stuff? The stuff is going to go to your great, great granddaughter when I have the most epic estate sale ever, Susan.